We need shelter. What are you doing, Ria? I am putting my doll to sleep in a house so that she can sleep comfortably. Well, we all need a house to live in. Yes, you are right, Nikita. A house protects us from bad weather like heat, cold, rain and storm. Yes, it also keeps us safe from thieves and stray animals. It even keeps away dust, dirt and insects. Nikita, do you know how many kinds of houses are there? Yes, I know. There are many different types of houses. People build houses according to their needs. Some houses are portable also. Yes, you are right. Portable houses are those which can be moved easily. Like a tent made of cloth or canvas. Soldiers and campers live in it. A houseboat floating on water is also a portable house. Nikita, do you know that the caravan is a portable house on wheels? Yes, Ria. Can you tell me about kacha houses? Yes, why not? Kacha houses are made of mud, wood, bamboo, clay and straw. They are temporary. They can be broken down and rebuilt easily. They are also called huts. Do you know about pakka houses? No, I am not very clear about it. A house made of brick, cement, steel, iron, concrete and wood is a pakka house. Are pakka houses stronger than kacha or portable houses? Yes, Ria. And most people in cities and towns lives in pakka houses. Pakka houses are of many types. Can you name them? Yes, a pakka house can be single story with only one floor. Double story with two floors. A bungalow or an apartment. Okay, and what is the difference between a bungalow and an apartment or a flat? Bungalows are big houses with lawns in front. And they are not joined to another house on either side. An apartment or a flat on the other hand is a house in a multi-storied building. I have also heard about two other types of houses. They are stilt houses and igloos. Do you know about them? Yes, stilt houses are built on high bamboo poles. We find them in places with heavy rainfall. Igloos are houses made of snow. They are built in extremely cold places. Can you name the different parts of a house? Yes, a house has many rooms. It has a roof on top. Each room in a house has walls on all sides and floor at the bottom. A house has many doors and windows. It has a dining room, bedroom, drawing room, kitchen, bathroom and an entrance. You are right. Grandma says that all rooms in a house must get proper sunlight and fresh air. So a house must have lots of windows. Nikita. Do you know about the people who make such beautiful houses for us? Yes, I asked Papa once. He told me that many people help us to build a house. An architect draws a plan and makes the design of the house. A mason lays the bricks and cements, the wall, floor and roof. A carpenter makes things of wood like doors and windows. A plumber fits the water pipes, sinks and taps. An electrician fits the electrical wires, lights, fans, bulbs, etc. A painter paints the walls, doors, windows, ceilings, etc. Now can you tell me something about how to have a good home? A house where a family lives is called a home. 
It is a place where we work and play together. Here are some things we can do to keep our house clean for it to be good. Dust things every day to keep away insects. Keep the surroundings of house clean. Keep the house free from cobwebs. Do not scribble on the walls. Empty and clean the dustbin every day. Sweep and mop the floor daily. Keep things in their proper places. 